Good morning, everyone. Um, today is a feast of Saints Cosmos and Damien. And the interesting thing is uh, trying to find out something about these saints. Uh, the, the texts tell us that not much is known about them, other than the devotion to them um, started developing around about the 5th century and uh, has become very in entrenched in, in the Church, to the extent that you would hear the names Cosmos and Damien mentioned uh, in the Eucharistic prayer every now and then. Um, so they are significant, and we're not sure why, but clearly enough they were um, important enough at the time um, for, for people to remember them. The, the Gospel reading uh, for this week, we're looking at Luke's Gospel, and it's uh, it, it, the passage that, that we have that Luke tells us about is the one where the apostles come and say, your mother and your brothers are outside and they want to see you. And there's a big crowd, obviously, that people that, that they couldn't get in. So they're saying, Jesus, look, you know, your mother and your brothers are outside. And and Jesus' response is one that is, is often um, hotly debated. He says, my brother, my mother and brothers are those who hear the word of God and put it into practice. Now, um, it, it's, it's important, again, to understand that we read our Gospels, we read our passages in English. They were not written or recorded in English. They would have been in, in Hebrew or in, in, in one of the, the current languages at the time. Um, and so we, we, we suffer from translations, if you like, where people would misunderstand exactly what it's all about. Now, clearly, when they talk about Jesus' mother, Jesus only had one mother. And yet he says, oh, my mother and brothers are those who hear the word of God. In other words, he includes Mary as one of those who hears the word of God and puts it into practice, if that is taken literally. And so again, are the, are the brothers supposed to also be taken literally? Because the brothers, uh, if, we, if we have a look at the origins of, of the word, uh, it, it has many derivatives, one of them um, being that anyone who is related to you would be considered to be your brother, your sister. So they could be cousins, they could be just people who know and remember the extended family, and they're considered to be brothers, but they weren't actually the children of Mary. But the other important thing is, is that Jesus says, those people who, who claim to be my brothers and sisters are those who hear the word and put it into practice. The challenge is there for us, that we mustn't just hear what God is saying, but we must go out and make it part of our real lives. And that's a big challenge for us today. You have a wonderful day and we'll see you again. God bless. Bye-bye.